Hello! Welcome sa aking video. Malama ang clinic mo ito dahil nahihirapan kang i-apply ang Polyas 4-Step Problem Solving Strategy at nagkahanap ka ng madaling explanation kung paano ito intindihin at gamitin. Halina at simulan na natin. But first, who is Polya? George Polya was a Hungarian mathematician known for his contributions to mathematical problem solving, combinatorics, and mathematical ed education. He was born in Budapest, Hungary and received his education at the University of Budapest, where he earned his doctorate in mathematics in 1912. Polya then worked as a teacher and researcher in various institutions. He is best known for his book, How to Solve It, which was first published in 1945 and has become a classic in mathematics education. Ano nga ba ang Polya's 4-step problem solving strategy? It is composed of 4 steps in solving mathematical problems which are First, understand the problem. Involves reading and analyzing the problem and determining what needs to be found. Second, devise a plan. Uses different strategies that is appropriate for the problem at hand. Examples are working back or drawing a diagram. Number three, carry out the plan. Implementing the device plan in step two. And fourth, review the solution. This involves checking the solution to make sure that it makes sense. Bakit ba natin kailangan gamitin ito? Sa paggamit ng strategy na ito, masasagot natin ang mga problem sa isang maayos at organisadong paraan upang mapaunlad natin ng ating problem solving skills. Tara na at i-apply na natin ang strategy na ito sa isang halimbawa. Problem. Brothers and sisters. I have two more sisters than brothers. Each of my sisters has two more sisters than brothers. How many more sisters than brothers that does my youngest brother have? First, we have to understand the problem. List what is known and unknown. The known is that I have two more sisters than brothers. And each of my sisters has two more sisters than brothers. The unknown is that how many more sisters than brothers does my youngest brother have? Next, we have to devise a plan. Assume that the speaker is a girl. We have at least three girls, the speaker which is X and two sisters which is X1 and X2. Next, we have to carry out the, the plan. Each sister would have two more sisters than brothers, the, the two sisters being the speaker and the other sis sister earlier mentioned. For example, X1 would have X2 and X as sisters. The youngest brother has four more sisters than brothers because he has X, X1, and X2 as sisters. Also, he has to remove himself from the count of the brothers. Thus, we can say that the final answer is 4. Then we have to review the solution. To illustrate, let's let Y be boys and X be the girls. We know that there are at least 3 girls and 1 boy, which is the youngest brother. In the case of X1, X2, X3, and Y1, X1 has 2 sisters and 1 brother. This is wrong because X1 has 2 more sisters than brothers. Then, we can have x1, x2, x3, x4, y1. This works because each girl has three sisters and one brother. So, all have two more sisters than brothers. Again, here, y1 has no brothers and four sisters. So, the difference is four. This is Rowan, hoping you have learned something. Thanks for listening. 